How's it going everyone? My name is Bobby and you're watching Mind Island Design. Today I'm going to show you how you can easily transform text to shapes or objects in Illustrator. I'm going to show you two different examples. So I'm just going to start with a simple circle and that size should do just fine. Let's make that uh, all into the center there. And then the text, I'm just going to write uh, Mind Island Design. Like so and I find it looks the best when the text is centered or aligned to the center. If it's aligned left or right, it just doesn't look symmetrical. So the next step we want to do is make sure that our text is below the object we want it to warp to. Select both your text and your object. Then at the top, click Object, Envelope Distort, Make with Top Object. And just like that, Illustrator does all the work and it, it warps your text to your object. So now the second example is I'm going to again make a circle and I'll just make the color. I mean, it doesn't really matter what your object color is. It'll just become your text color. But uh, yeah, so let's place the circle there aligned to the center. I'm going to grab the pen tool and just make some different shapes and cut them out of this uh, object here. So uh, let's do just some random, some random pattern. Perfect, and I'll just change that object color just so we can see it easier. Uh, yellow will just be fine. Select both of these shapes and then go to Window, Pathfinder, and then click Divide. So now each of these shapes are on their own layer. Um, you can use either the direct selection tool to select each individual um, shape or I'm just going to select the entire um, group and then go to object ungroup so now yeah each layer is uh, on its own layer or each object is on its own layer so now let's make some text for this so this is gonna be kind of three parts I'm gonna have the top one one uh, one text second text third text so I want to have the same same uh, text there, Mind Island Design. Split into three separate parts there. So now if I select the... Well, first of all, we want to make sure that all the uh, text is below these shapes. So I'm going to just go to uh, Object, Arrange, Send to Back. Now if I select the top text and the top object, same process, Object, Envelope, Distort, Make with top object, middle text, middle object, arrange, or make with top object, and then just copy that process a third time. Perfect. And now we can just delete the extra objects on the side. And there we go. So that is how you warp text to shapes or objects in Illustrator. I hope this helped. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.